Hey, what's up, everybody? This is DJ Fanatic Beats, content contributor for LiveOffBeats.com. Uh, in today's video, I'm going to give you a quick little tip in Nexus 2. Um, definitely, it's an awesome way to find new sounds and also not manipulate, but kind of get into the layers of uh, the presets that are in Nexus 2. There's tons of them, and it's like a lot of producers don't know about. Um, definitely don't use it and this is something that i overlooked for a long time as well so anyway uh if you'd like to follow me you can always follow me at sounds for producers on instagram as well as uh, dj fanatic beats on instagram as well and fanatic is spelled p-h-a-n-a-t-i-c so let's jump right into it um this first sound that i pulled up is like the the, in the sound that comes up as soon as you load up nexus is the ld saw Notice it's lush, it's full, it's loud, um, but one thing that most of these sounds have in Nexus that a lot of producers overlook is the layers in the sounds. Uh, I'm going to choose this sound just to show an example, then I'm going to check another one. Um, there's different layers to the sound, so let me dissect. What you want to do, uh, it's already, you know, the loaded sound, you, what you want to do is go to the uh, mix button here. And you notice there's a bunch of little options up here at the top. You want to go to lay, L-A-Y, short for layers. And this sound actually only has one layer. I'm shocked. If you turn it all the way down, notice there's no sound. I'm playing on my keyboard right now. And you can actually mute it, turn it on and off. And I think I messed it up. Hold on. There we go. So you have to click next to the volume to raise it. So if you click anywhere, it won't match. If you click here, it won't move up. So you have to click it right next to the volume. So anyway, that was a horrible example. That has one sound, but just go back to the library and choose. Let's go to the new Christmas 2018. They had a lot of cool sounds in this free update. Uh, let's do a pad because uh, Grandfather Star. Let's check that out. That's a pluck, actually. Let's choose a pad. Sweet pad. Let's see what that is. Imagination. That should have some layers. So go to the... Uh, what was it again? The mix button and layers. Notice this has three, right? And it looks like it's a little glitch. So if I lower or turn off layer one... Notice it's a totally different sound. And you have kind of your own unique sound because you eliminate a layer from what was preset. It's not any longer a pad really, it's more like a soft lead. And you can um, mute other layers. Now it's more like a saw sound. Of course you would have to adjust the volume because you notice the volume is really low. And let's say I just mute that and nothing plays. Let's say I just want this uh, layer to play, player, uh, layer one. Totally different sound from what it was before with all. Let's say I just want layer two. I just made a trap beat. You see what I'm saying? So you get the idea. But all the different sounds in Nexus, which is a lot, especially if you got expansions like this, um, you can even get more, uh, um, even have more access to sound. It's kind of almost like sound design, but you're taking away, like uh, subtractive synthesis. You're taking away from something that they made in order to create something new. And it's definitely powerful because you're kind of making your own unique sound that no one else really made. That's a cool sound. It's like a angel's harp. So let's go to the mix and it's already on layer. So notice there's like two layers, one four under section one. So I guess they broke every sound down differently. So if you mute, let's just mute all of them but two. 
let's get three in there. So it's more like air. Hear that in the background? See? It's like a soft string in the background. Let's say we want just one and three. It's one and four. It's labeled four. So you get the idea. And you can use a combination of raising certain layers. And if you're not really, you know, knowledgeable of sound design, you can kind of start here and just experiment with different things and learn by just muting and raising volumes on certain layers that you like. In a way, it is a form of sound design. It's just, um, you know, playing around with the levels of the layers under underneath the presets. So there you go. Quick video. Again, it's DJ Fanatic Beats. Hopefully, um, you know, this helped you as far as discovering more sounds and you know if you want to spend an hour or two just messing around you can create um, unique sounds this way and that are separate from the sounds that other designers made and separate from the expansions that you bought because you're kind of making it your own and that's what music's all about it's an art form you know express yourself through the art so if you'd like to follow me again you can follow me at sounds for producers on Instagram as well as DJ Fanatic Beats Spell P H A N P H A N A T I C uh, on Instagram. So feel free to explore. Keep exploring. Go through every sound. You can make whatever you want. And uh, don't be afraid of the tools that you purchase or the tools that you have in your in your laptop. And again, it's DJ Fanatic Beats, content contributor for LiveOffBeats.com. Peace.